one big dead iguana. Woo! Oh my god. Oh my god. We just jumped the fence behind us, parked the car, and the local said it's okay that we can go up here. Hello! Hi. Yeah! One guy said zigzag, this guy said straight ahead. The other guy said they're snakes that are poisonous, but nobody's died yet. So we shall see. So I'm walking along. We're going up to that hole up there. We're busting through stuff like this, and I almost put my foot onto that. Oh, that is one big dead iguana. It's probably two feet. Oh, its tail goes all the way down there. That's like a three or four foot long iguana dead. He wouldn't want to be you. Get up. Class five boulder scramble here. And there's like. I mean, it's kind of like holds. I bet dangerous. you it goes up and I mean, over. It's dangerous, but it's. Don't do this at home. We have definitely come up fast. Trying to climb up. Making it over. We're almost there. Here we are. It's probably bigger than um, the camera's showing. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god. That scared me to death. <laughs> I was looking up and there is a dead snake. Well, at least it's dead. We got that going for us. Definitely bats. Yeah, there's interesting sounds. All right, well, you could say I might be the most freaked out I've been since I've been here. <laughs> I think we're in the least amount of danger too, but it's Freaky in here. Yeah, that was, yeah, that is weird. But you can hear the bats. They are like all around us, and there's these weird bugs like everywhere. <laughs> oh, if you can see them, they must be in the cockroach family. Oh, yeah, they're staying away from my feet, but. Chip said, be quiet, and I'm thinking, I want to be as loud as I can, so these things leave me alone. But I think they're not on the sandy part, so let's go to the sandy part. Ooh, and that might be, ooh, that might just actually be bat droppings. Ooh, oh man, wow. load of bats up in this cave and I'm gonna shine my light up there listen to how much they get active here we go whoa that is a bunch of bats holy crap whoa they're going nuts I think I'm gonna cut my light out <laughs> wow man that was so crazy just thousands of them flying around. Luckily, I'm kind of over near a rock, so um, they're not pooping on my head. Man, that's crazy. You can hear them, they sound like mice. I need to come in here again. Okay, you ready? Yes, I'm here. Here it goes. Oh my god. Wow. That is amazing. There are thousands of bats up there. And when you shine the light, they fly around. Wow. That is so wild. That is creep -ola. Wow. All right, well, I couldn't take it any longer. I mean, I went pretty far back in there, and I got the creeps. 
So we're obviously not the only ones who've ever been up here, but there certainly aren't many people that come up here. So we just got back and as the guy warned us, although we didn't know what he was warning us of, he was warning us of these little things. And yep. he I walked through them on the way up and the way back. He made on your arms. He <laughs> tried to warn us and we definitely got it. Uh, here's, here's mine. I didn't have um, sleeves on, so <laughs> I just have a little bit of a tingling sensation on my arms right hot. now. It's so funny how cold it was up in the cave and like yeah, totally I've been I stopped dripping. sweating and now yeah. I'm totally hot. We're not even putting out much effort oh. and <laughs> we're just dripping. Yeah.